Morning guys, welcome to Monday the 7th of October. It's a drizzly, cool, well dank day really. Cloudy, it's not going to be a nice day. And it was a bright, bright red sunrise this morning. It's a beautiful shepherd's warning. Which isn't what I was wanting. <laughs> As you can see I'm down by the river again. The uh, river is back into her banks, which is good. Uh, we've still got water stood all over the place um, but I've just come down just to check the river bank in itself and the fencing the river bank has a, a tendency to slide in and one of our fences has a tendency to float uh, I'm not entirely sure how high the water got I'm fairly sure it might have come over the top of this banking over this levee right the way down um, I'm just down by the bridge as well. This is a good indication for me of where the river's going, if it's going up, down, or indifferent. And at the moment, don't know how well you can see that, but if I throw a stick in, one stick, yeah, that's heading the wrong way. <laughs> Basically, the river's coming back up again. Um, so, back to square one, back to making sure everything's bolted down, shut down, tied down, horses are in the right place, as you can see it hasn't, it hasn't moved very far, um, in fact there's a nice dark trail here, this is the other problem we'll have now for the next week or so, is after the floods have been it leaves a, a lovely silty deposit across the grass, obviously you don't want stock cabins not eaten um, so we try and try and keep them away but not much you can do about it and um, the rain will wash it off again it's a bit like slurry in a field Ooh, a bit like slurry in a field you have to give it a few days to to wash yourself off my soil pile still here <laughs> that's good I say this is a soil pile that I moved down from a job I did in the before summer I think it was um, moved all this down here two weeks ago with the idea of it being used for a, a bridging area over there where the ditch is obviously at the moment it's a bit wet yeah so if it's coming back up we'll be having some fun for a while um, I don't know if you can see right down there that's still a hayfield <laughs> And that's still flooded out. You can probably hear now the rain's getting harder. So we're in for a wet Monday. Uh, not entirely sure what I'm going to be doing today to be honest because I can't drive on the land. The only real fields I can actually drive on is this one down by the riverbank as it's uh, quite a sandy soil, loamy soil, whereas the rest of it's pretty much clay. So we might be on the inside jobs. Um, it has now started putting me back a little bit on my uh, job sheet as uh, Farmer P managed to do uh, I was supposed to be out spiking generally this time of year just before the rains come and the heavy rains come I take the little grey Fergie out and start spiking I managed to do one field this year <laughs> and that was I think last Monday I managed to do that um, and the rest of the acreage isn't going to get done we have got standing water in some of the other fields that the horses are in at the moment just from surface water so probably won't be able to get onto them for quite a while so it looks like I could be onto either a bit of fencing or a bit of maintenance machinery maintenance hopefully um, but yeah we'll see what happens it can't last like this forever and uh, <laughs> there you go just shows what the river's like when it's in uh, when it's fairly full and it'll be after a tree and some firewood <laughs> 